Hi, this is Tom McMillan with the Lead One Bite of the Week. College football attendance has now declined for four straight years. And this is a big issue being discussed across the board. Why are people not going to football games as much anymore? The answer is complex. Inconvenient weeknight games, lesser quality opponents, and television are all factors. College football is more available to multimedia consumers than ever before. Not only is practically every major college football game televised, they're also often streamed on the internet, making them available to anyone who has a mobile phone. And let's not forget that Generation Z, today's college students, have shown an unwillingness to attend games and watch broadcasts unless it's on their cell phone. Outside of the television factor, tickets have also become harder to sell due to ticket and concession costs, game length, and the hassle factor of parking, traffic, and the like. As a response for a better in-game experience, many of our schools are amplifying amenities in other ways by lowering concession costs or adding unique features. It's happening everywhere in the FBS from our group of five schools to the autonomy five schools. The Pac-12 is making efforts to shorten football game times. UCF installed a beach club in its football stadium Stanford is in the midst of renovating its antenna system for 5G cellular connectivity. Akron, together with a local radio station, has sponsored free music festivals before home games. And Alabama plans to add a student terrace to create a more interactive and social environment. Decreasing fan attendance is an all-encompassing issue, and the solution is not simple. This is not breaking news, but it's a real concern, an important issue with our ADs. That's our Bite of the Week.